Hello and welcome to this short explanation video on voice meter banana. To use voice meter audio banana, you'll have to go to the site. Just go to Google. It might as well just be it. type in voice meter banana. And you'll see the two options. This is the, the easiest way to do it. You have the voice meter audio software, blah, 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 blah. Just go, you, you, there's an option that you go to the voice meter, to this one. This is not the one that you want. You want banana, because it will give you more options. Now, how do you download it? Well, also, advice. Go to the bottom, and you see two download options. I usually go for the EXA, because I am lazy. Uh, there's a lot of configuration stuff if you're into that, even explanation. So once you did that, once you downloaded it, once you installed it, you will see this window. And it will be empty. Now, how to put in, uh, you see that I've placed in here my uh, microphone. This is of everything to do with uh, how I record my videos. Uh, and, and you can see this option going back to the uh, OBS Studio. It's also in there, but that's another video. We will not be talking about it. Uh, also, you have a few options now. I'll, I'll, for this one, I will enable myself to hear it. If you press A2, you will be on your own stream as well. Now, there is a few of options you can change. Of course, if you really want to use them, then go ahead. I haven't had to use them thankfully because oh, wow also putting on a2 that's really confusing now this one is your noise gate it says here in front of you uh, place the normally down to two um, you see that yeah that that's the noise from my desktop uh, placing it to one might as well help it's it's a bit getting used to the controls but if, if I stop talking now it is gone now I always I, I've said it myself to three main reason is you will not hear every time that I'm breathing see you didn't hear that one the one thing that you will need to remember is, is that you will have these sort of cuts by your um, audio files. Uh, this one, yeah, you can use it. I, um, I, I don't know if you want to. I don't use it anyway. So, if you placed in your hardware input, you can also do in like your voice meter VAWA. Now, so my standard device has been set to AUX input. And my voice meter input as well for standard listening device. And the way that I am um, recording is folks output and voice meter output. That has everything to do with these two things. But your input, you will place them in here. Uh, as you can see here, folks aux, and that's this one. And folks VAIO is this one why those two well if you are going to do collaborations with people you might want to have your skype or whatever you are going to plan to use because with discord uh, voice you can set it to snowball but here you have the other uh, inputs as well so because i, I usually I, I don't have to record and to record my own voice over and over and over again so they will hear this one an output device you can place to like like here Personally, I think it's this one. Now, as for your Skype, if you go to your settings, and yes, this is in Dutch. I, I, I am, I'm Dutch, so you go to your audio input, your audio files. I have this one also, unfortunately. But do remember, you want if you want to record what your what other people are saying, you want to make sure that this one is also set. So it will be recorded into VoiceMeter Bandana. Now there's a simple way you can test this. Of course, if this is working, let me place this one to the side and you'll see this one going up shortly. There's this echo sound test. So we're going to do a quick call.
Hallo en welkom bij de testservice van Skype. Na de pieptoon kunt u een bericht inspreken van maximaal 10 seconden. Daarna laten we u dit bericht terug horen. Wow, that is taking an awful long time. Now, as you can see, uh, this doesn't change. Now, if you put in the settings wrong, you will see your own meter as well. So, 10 seconds should be up now. Wow, that is taking an awful long time. Now, as you can see, uh, this doesn't change. Now, if you put in the settings wrong, you will see your own meter as well. So, 10 seconds should be up. Als u uw eigen stem kon horen. Yeah, my, I could hear my own voice. Thank you very much. Let's close this one up. Now, did you see this? This meter is changing now, so you will have that this is going on on one single audio file, and your voice is what your computer is doing. You can change these, of course, if you right-click, you can change the name, uh, like I did to Skype and etc. Don't forget to press Enter. Input is really the. It is just a drop-down menu. Uh, right-clicking will tell you. Other things you can do. I, I I don't even know what some of these things do. They're, they're probably very handy, but I don't use them. I just want to record my own voice. Um, so game audio. If you want to hear it on, if you want to hear your own voice, by the way, on the audio track of the Skype, press an A1, and you will always hear the. So you will have your own voice and other people's voice. I don't see the value on that. I want to hear their voices and not anything else. So if you want to have your own voice in your game audio file, present to, I don't think it's going to be a great plan. And uh, you will also hear your own self if you press an A2. So if that's enabled, you will hear your own self speaking. If you have a really good microphone or, or headset, which are, uh, I have an okay one. I can still hear myself talking, so I, I don't have to have it on. But it can be really confusing because at some point you might be out of sync a few seconds, and that's what's going to be very, very annoying. Also, training yourself to listen to your own voice, it's going to be absolutely difficult. Now, this is the first video I'm going to redo my OBS video as well and I'm going to show you uh, how you could set up your um, what's the program that I'm using again uh, movie studio 13 from the steam version so I'll make sure all the links are in the description if you have any questions or feedback do feel free to contact me in the comment section if you want to have other discussions then feel free to join me on discord be free to join me on the Steam group as well as just email me. I hope this is going to be long enough and I hope to see you next time. Have a good day and a very good night. Goodbye.